Montville's your town, you want to make that move, but you don't know what $800,000 can get for you in the beautiful town of Montville, this is the video for you. Stay tuned. It's a video tour. My name is Sean McIntyre. I am the team leader of the Living in North Jersey real estate team. I'm getting emails, texts, phone calls every single day from people just like you looking to move to the area. So whether you're looking to buy in nine days or 90 days, it doesn't make a difference. Shoot me a text, give me a call, send me an email. I'll be happy to assist on that next move that you're looking to make. We are in beautiful Montville, New Jersey. Oh, I love this town. And uh, we're going over what $800,000 can get for you. So make sure you stick around to the end because you're going to want to see this entire house. You're not going to want to miss a beat of it because uh, it is a nice one. This is a Center Hall Colonial in um, the town of Montville. Five bedrooms, two and a half baths. We're going to be going through everything here so you know exactly what to look, what you're going to get when you move in the town. This particular community we are in is the Valhalla section of town. Now look, I'm not going to go into full detail on Montville because I have a video that goes into full detail. So I'll put that in the description or maybe you're going to see it pop up right here. Just click that video when the time comes. That way uh, you know exactly what you're getting into with Montville. Here we are, the entranceway to the home, grand front door. You're gonna be going up to uh, the bedrooms up top, basement down below. It, you know how this works, right? <laughs> but we, our first stop here is gonna be one of the living rooms. Um, a beautiful hardwood floors throughout. It's a nice an inch and a half oak. And then you have a nice parquet floor here in the family room. Beautiful fireplace, love the fireplace. Nice ceiling heights, not bad. This is really, really nice here. So you can see that the home does need some updating. I wanna point that out because let's say that this was up to par and it was really, really on the top of its game. Maybe it didn't have you know, the old wood paneling, some nice sheetrock with some recessed lights and all that kind of stuff. But we are talking about a potential million dollar home here. So I just wanna make sure that you fully understand that this is a very nice home, but it has potential to be even more after it's renovated, if you decide to. But look, it's not terribly outdated. So here we are in one of the first bathrooms. This is the half bath on the first level. Very nice, so your guests don't have to go upstairs or go to your bathrooms. You know, you give them a nice uh, bathroom next to the family room and kitchen. So here we are in the kitchen area. So you have a nice little eat-in kitchen area over here where you put a table, very nice. Um, kitchen is in pretty good shape. It's if you like the uh, you know if you like the look of everything with the counter, the, the darker look, darker cabinets. That's for you. Perfect. Darker floors. All right, and that's a nice hardwood. Looks like a three and a quarter inch cherry flooring. All right, as we go through here, we have laundry room, which goes on to the outside. Um, personally, what I would do in here is convert this into another bathroom. And I want you to put a comment below if you think that's a good idea or not. But really the reason for that is, you know, it gives you another bathroom and you could always do a stackable unit. You got the space in here. All right, and here is the first bedroom. So for me, I'd make this the guest bedroom just because, uh, you know, you have the bedrooms upstairs. What's your thoughts on that green? Is it, is it in, is it not? <laughs> Drop a comment. All right, so let's continue this journey here. Formal dining room. All right, let's go see what upstairs has to offer. Bedroom number one, spacious, not bad. Bedroom number two, here we are. Overlook in the backyard, lots of natural light, love it. All right, we got the upstairs bathroom. Here we are, boom. Not bad. Bedroom number three. 
a little bit smaller than the other ones, but love the natural light. Still a very, very spacious bedroom. Master bedroom. Closet, very spacious. Nice area for getting ready. Got some closet space and then the full bath. All right. We are on 0.62 acres. Uh, that's pretty good size lot. There is sewer in the street, which is nice. Uh, so this is septic, but it will be converted to sewer, which is something that is a requirement in the towns uh, or in the community here in the Valhalla Hall area. So potential here for a full basement. Um, it is unfinished at the moment, but you've got the high ceilings. Uh, you definitely have the possibility of making this into family room um, or anything like that. All right, want to compare maybe what $800,000 can get for you in another town? Well, I'm gonna put that right here and uh, why don't you click that video and you can see what $800,000 can get you in Rockaway Township, New Jersey. All right, so that's the tour of the home. It was great seeing you once again. Remember, click subscribe, hit the bell so you don't miss out on future videos. We're all over Northern New Jersey and have a lot of content coming out. You wanna make sure you don't miss out on it.